Hello, 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 I'm Laura Laura and today I thought that I would show you how to create a really, really simple smoky eye with all drugstore high street products that you can get from Boots and Superdrug. So let's just get on with it. I forgot to say that I have already done my face makeup, I'm just cracking on straight on with the eyes as that's what you've come to see. So first of all, as a base, I'm just going to take my Maybelline Colour Tattoo 24 hours in on and on bronze with my Real Techniques base shadow brush and sorry that I'm looking there I get so worried that I'm gonna be out of focus am I out of focus oh my goodness now I am now I'm not okay so um, I'm just gonna take this on this tiny little brush and um, I'm just gonna you can apply it as much as you want really depends how harsh you're gonna do the outside of your eye and how much you're going to apply. If you want it quite light and you want to add some more white onto the inside then I'll go quite lightly with this whereas if you want it just two colours then you can go quite dark. So I'm just going to apply this all over my lid. And then I'm literally just like stroking it in the um, thingy. And the same with the other eye. So I'm literally doing this, I'm doing it quite rough on the outside of my eye, but then quite smooth on the inside. But applying more to the outside so it's more like a base for it, so it will stick better. I'm just going to take my collection uh, Eyes Uncovered palette in, in the nude palette, so it's the plain one. And I'm just going to take the th fourth one in from the left, which is Chocolate Milk quite a weird name um, and I'm just going to kind of apply this to the centre with my MAC 217 I don't know if I said that um, I'm just going to take a little bit there is quite a lot of fallout with this um, so don't put too much or too much on your brush try and apply it in layers so I'm just going to apply this kind of to the centre and blend it out a little bit Now that I've applied that and it's kind of mattified, um, I'm just going to take the darker shade in the palette, which is Espresso, on the MAC 217, just on the other side. I don't really care about my brushes. I really should, actually. <laughs> Am I still not? Yep, I'm in focus. Woo! Okay, I'm just applying some to the end of this, and I'm just going to apply it to the outside of my eye, and then blend it slightly more inside in the crease. So there is one eye. Depending on how smoky you want it, you can apply more further in, less further out, whatever you want to do really. Right, the lighting isn't very good on this side, so let's try our best. And then you just want to kind of match them up if you've gone slightly more on one eye than the other. I can see I've gone a lot more on this side, but you can tidy it up with a cotton bud if you want to. Um, I'm just going to leave it at that, but then I'm just going to take the lighter shade on my middle finger and apply it to the inside corner of my eye. So I'm just tapping that on and then blending it out a little bit with my finger. Right, as you can see I've got it on my, eyel on my eyelash, but that doesn't matter because now we're going to apply mascara. And um, I've been using the Maybelline Lash Sensational Lash Multiply Mascara. It's really good for a drugstore um, high street alternative. I think it's about eight pounds, which really isn't too bad. Um, and I'm just gonna apply, I've already curled my lashes. Let's sit a bit closer so I can actually focus. Oh, I'm gonna get a bit of light on my nose. Right, apologies for the bad lighting, like always. You can apply some to your bottom blah. You can apply some to your bottom lashes if you want to. Classic Laura, got it under my nose. Oh, there we go. So there we go. Um, I would usually apply a couple of coats. 
but you get the general gist of it. Now I have got a um, cosmetic bud from Boots. I'm just going to wet it down and then sweep under my eye just to collect any excess that's fallen under there. And also turn the um, end of my smoky eye into more of an angle so that it doesn't look too messy. You can leave it messy if you want to, if that's the kind of look you're going for. So there we go, there is a final look. Apologies again for the lighting. I know it's really bad, I'm really sorry. Um, so you can always apply more mascara. You can apply it on your bottom lashes. You can apply eyeliner if you want to. I'm just gonna leave it at that. Like always, this is open to interpretation. Please use your own products if you don't. You don't have to go and buy all of these. But um, definitely, I would really, really recommend the Maybelline Color Tattoo in On and On Bronze. I use it nearly every day <laughs> and it's so easy just to apply this during the daytime and then go for the darkest shade in this palette um, when you want to transition in, into evening for more of a smoky eye but like I say it's up to you honestly. If you do recreate this look remember to tag me on Instagram and Twitter and wherever else Laura underscore Westlake is my username on most social media platforms. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. I haven't done a makeup tutorial in about six months. Sorry, I'm really, really sorry guys. Um, honestly, I love making these and I hope you enjoy watching them too. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you are having an amazing week. Remember to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.